Hey everybody and welcome to Stock Abilities. Today I'm going to be covering um, four interesting stocks here. We're going to start off with Delcat because this is the one that essentially led the charge. A lot of them followed suit from some, I'd say, questionable individuals, but we're going to not get too much into that. The basis of why Delcath ran in the first place, one of the main motivators was that it was not approved based upon the following votes as, as a proposal received fewer votes in favor than the required majority of the total number of outstanding shares as of the record date recorded by Delaware Law. Now essentially this means they can't reverse split, they can't increase their price, they're still non-compliant for the stock market. And they're running out of time so they got to do something my theory is that they're trying to push it up to acquire enough shares to push the vote through themselves and this is just kind of a wild assumption and there's some other things in the filings that might indicate that's not the case but i don't believe those are quite the scenario you're looking for maybe a pump and a pump and a pump and then all of a sudden you're going to get a reverse split out of nowhere they're going to do another vote and it's very likely going to pass this next time around but we're going to get into that here in a second it's been kind of all over the place i mean just last friday it was six cents went all the way up to 33 cents and it's been kind of fizzling out lately uh you want to get in these particular stocks when they are in the short sale restriction currently it is in the short sale restriction and it looks like it hit about i would say 23 cents down something like that so you might see a potential bounce up to maybe 25 26 as i'm doing this video as you can see it is on june 22nd uh, kind of maybe a quick scalp into the morning and then maybe a further dip and then probably possibly bouncing around in that area. I'm not going to go too much into detail there. The thing you want to note is that all these other stocks aren't really popping anything special. They're just simply following suit as you can see here. Very similar pattern with Dexterra Surgical Inc. in the last five days and you got Mara here who started a little bit later but followed the very same pattern again and you got any and if you look here you got this pattern here this pattern here this pattern here that started a little later and this one that started a little later as well with any uh, you might want to be looking into other stocks that are of the similar range price that might run as well probably a shorter gap uh, somewhere in this range rather than the longer range here that you see with these looks like it's getting tighter and tighter and tighter and a lot of these are probably going to potentially reverse split, maybe even around the same time. They seem to all be being pumped up, and a lot of them seem to have an upcoming reverse split uh, indication here soon. They're very risky to play, but if you play them right, they are big scalps. Uh, $0.24 cents to $0.26, cents, for example, is a lot of money if you play enough shares, because you're buying shares at a very, very cheap price, so it's a lot of amplification of the value uh thanks for listening in if you have any other questions or if you have any input that you want to share below make sure to leave it in the comments below make sure to like this video subscribe to the channel and share this video if you'd like and if you want any other videos done on any particular stocks or something like that just pop me a message and give me a heads up have a nice day